I got diagnosed on a Tuesday and it was the Wednesday practice and uh, kind of brought everybody off the ice and just kind of um, got the team in the locker room and broke the news. And uh, yeah, that's just kind of how it happened uh, very organically and some uh, tears were shed there for sure. But um, honestly, I was feeling better after I told everybody and uh, just because of the support I got in the locker room. I think it surprised and shocked everybody and, it's amazing how the kid, how Zach's handled it. it uh, he, he's been awesome. And this is obviously something that came up. You don't plan for it. You know, he was off to a good start, right? I mean, we were kind of rotating those guys. And, and next thing you know, he's he's going through what he's going through. And the game becomes very secondary. Um, I can tell you that, you know, his health uh, and well-being are the number one thing. And the beauty of being on a team is you got a lot of support. And, you know, you've got your family and you've got your friends and then you've got your teammates. And I think our guys really did a great job uh, of supporting him. You know, you look at kind of what Patter and those guys did for, you know, the November thing and then just to kind of coincide it and, and just all those things. It was a tough few months there, obviously. Uh, kind of the unknown was the scariest part. But honestly, the guys that are on the team helped me through it the whole way through. And uh, I got to rejoin the team in January, and that's the happiest I've ever been. Even after the diagnosis and how he wanted to handle it, we gave him his time until he was comfortable to, to share it with, you know, you guys. And, and uh, you know, you got to respect that for, for those players. And and when the time was right, he did. And But he's, he's handled it great. And... Like we say, we're all we're all excited to get him back and in, in the net, and I know he's probably the most happy to to be back in there because that's where he's comfortable. For him, it was making sure that he's had some good weeks of practice. He's progressing, and I think uh, you know, in talking to him the last couple of weeks and talking with Brant and who's working with him every week, you know, I think he was in a good spot, and so you know, there there was conversation as a coaching staff, you know. Prior to the Denver weekend, you know, when and if was that opportunity for him to play? So that's been discussed. I mean, obviously, this is a different circumstance, but he was ready. Obviously, I was uh, super excited. Um, Ryan kind of was telling me before the game he wasn't feeling well. So kind of all the way through that first period, I kind of knew I was going to go in just because he was hurting in warm-ups and uh, hurting during the first period. So, But obviously, uh, really excited I got that opportunity for sure. You get ready through practices and, and you prepare yourself uh, to be ready to play when called upon. And that's what I think is cool about Zach. I mean, he's just kind of gone about his business and he's worked hard and he's added workloads every week to, to get to a point where he feels comfortable and confident. And I think that showed in the way he played when he went in there. Just kind of after feeling that first shot, kind of gets you into the game as a goalie and um, to just be back on the ice with, with all the guys again, it was a, it was a special moment. That was for sure. One of the uh, bigger wins I've had in my career here. Um, just with the situation, everything going on. Um, it was super special, super emotional. Obviously it was Zach coming in, just a great kid, put a smile on his face every day at the ring. So to get that win, you know, with him in the net was awesome. Yeah. I mean, obviously we've, we've won some big games here in my four years, but that one was, was unique for sure. And it was, it was super special. You know, the win's the win, but just, you know, to, to to see what he's gone through, to get him back in there, you know, to get a win, you know, those are those are special times. Like, you, you know, we don't know, like, when that, when this stuff happens, you don't know, right? I mean, you don't know if you're going to play, you don't know how well you're going to play, how you're going to get through it. I mean, you appreciate every day, and now, you know, he gets an opportunity to go in there and win, and yeah, I mean, I think for our whole team, it was a little bit emotional. These aren't injuries. You know, when you're talking about cancer, I mean, it's it's scary, right? And, and and we've all had people that have gone through it. And, you know, to see him pull through and be in the position he's in right now uh, is awesome and cherishing every day and got the smile on his face.